Five men charged in the death of Yvonne Young plead not guilty. Young disappeared on New Year's Day. Prosecutors say he was killed. His body tossed in a dumpster. Beverly Taylor in court this morning with the men who were charged with that crime. Five men are charged with first degree intentional homicide in the killing of Ivan Young, and all five plead not guilty. Please, I'll enter on behalf of the defendants not guilty. Two of them, Billy Griffin, Young's roommate, and Victor Stewart, had separate hearings. They're also the two who provided authorities with vivid accounts of what happened. Stewart did not testify in the preliminary hearing of the other three Ashanti McAllister, Devin Seabury, and Ron yeah. Allen. But Detective Timothy Griffin testified about what Stewart told him, saying the incident stemmed from a burglary at Billy Griffin's home that Young was supposedly involved in. He indicated that defendant McAllister struck the victim twice in the face with the semi-auto handgun while in the kitchen. Graham says according to Stewart, Young still did not know how much danger he was in. He said the, the victim was cooperative um, and the victim didn't believe that he was going to be killed. Uh, he followed them into the basement. He also said Allen put a bag, a plastic bag, over Young's head that broke and then choked Young with a chain. He indicated that Mr. McAllister fired three shots at the victim. They wrapped Young's body in a bed sheet. Allen left the house and returned with duct tape and bleach and a change of clothes for himself and Allen. Allen duct taped the feet and hands. They finished cleaning the basement and they all took showers using the bleach. Uh, to clean the blood off themselves. After cross-examination, the judge ruled there was enough evidence for a trial. The men are accused of tossing Young's body in a dumpster after killing him. Search crews have been sorting through a landfill in Menominee Falls this week, but have not yet found Young's body. Ted and Mary? Bev, thank you. 518, time for news and weather together.